Right, hey guys and welcome back to the next vlog on the farm. So, we need to, well, this road is now being closed, as you can see, the signs out road closed, log trucks turning ahead because, and I'll just sprint down here just to show you what's happening the farm is in development guys that farm needs analysing with the precision farming tool and we'll get on to that the road's closed down here so not even the public houses can go through so I don't know how that car's going to get out but it'll have to figure that one out I may have made a mistake because I've left my trailer in here and I've left the mower in here. Hmm. Yes, I didn't think of that one. But... I didn't even think of that getting... Oh God. I've worked one thing out today and this is one thing that I've worked out quite badly and tree throwing's in progress over there so I'm not going near there. So... That's one thing we've kind of worked out quite badly. But yes, this area is all under construction. Which is why the money's gone down from just over 100 to 79. So it's October the 3rd. I did want to cut that grass up there, but there is nothing I can do about it. Yeah, there's nothing that I can really be doing about it. So. Yeah, we'll just have to hopefully get a late November cut. But if not, then that's one grass field we've possibly lost this year. But the first job that I want to do is I want to check on my field. We planted this with canola last year. And this field has got linseed in it. It does need fertilizer and it does need rolling. So that's what I'm going to get. Well, I'm going to get Noah. Noah did call me to say that he's going to come down and help me. Martha's a little bit busy today, so it's going to have to be Noah who does it for me. But that's fine. So I think the rollers at the back of the yard. I could be wrong and I could be right. Let me just put my phone on silent. Sorry about the inactiveness of vlogs. But my phone that I used to work on the farm broke. So I had to and it also, I use it to record, help record these videos. So, I don't just use my camera and my drone, I'm also using my phone. So, I've had to buy a new phone, so that's another reason why the money's gone down. So, we are having to really save. And, yeah, I'm trying not to break the phone. Otherwise, I'm not buying a new one because my mum's... Well, that's what my mum says as well because I've spent too much on phones. So... We need to save the, we need to save the pounds and the pennies will save themselves. So, we need to get rolling. The class tractor that we had has gone back to the dealership. So I'll let Noah jump in with that. 
Yeah, Noah is doing that. So that's looking nicely rolled. And yes, this field I'm going to get done for here. So I will see you in a minute. Actually, no, I won't. I'll show you what we've got with this trailer. We've got all the seed bags. The fertilizer is still at the store. Yes, I know we should have brought it up, but we will get it when we go down there with the spreader. They just told us to unload it and someone will put it in for us for us. So seed, mineral feed and size additive is all back to the farm. I think the fence is round here. Yeah, because I was compacting the pit last night. I think after we recorded the vlog I was spent sat here compacting. So what I'll do is I will finish what I was doing on camera. That's the straw bales. I've had to move everything off the yard because they're coming round to landscape so I'm having to stay out of the ways and things. That's why the straw bales outside which need to go under cover before winter starts. So we'll drop them off. Because after winter we're having a massive change of yard. So we're actually have to, going to be saving up for some new sheds as well. But that's one thing that's left to, left to come. So what I'll do is I'll just go into... I'll have to go into third person just so I can drive up there. Just because it would be nice to get it completely back in the pit. Otherwise it may not cover. night as well. After we got it all in the pits he did go over with the compaction tool. And yeah we will we are mapping a few houses built for these workers. And I'll tell you what else they're building in town. They're wanting to build a supermarket now. Where they're wanting to build it, I'm not agreeing to it with, which I have put in some, as I say, my mum's put in some objection plans. Because, well, I'll show, I'll just, I'll show you. I'll show the vlog, and I'll, let, I'll see what the vlog decides, because they're not in the greatest of places. Yes, we are looking for a new mayor of the town, of the village, a village mayor, and there is going to be held, held a vote, I think it's going to be on the radio as well, Possib I will try and do a vlog where it's held on the radio so you can hear. But I think it'd be the next episode. It just depends. And I'm trying to get back scheduling again vlogs. So I'll just get this finished compacted. And I'll be back again very shortly. See you in a minute, guys. Right then, welcome back, guys, to the vlog. 
I'll just park this tractor in here. So, this pit is now compacted, so I will put the cover over. I've been, I've been getting it out and thin, so I just need to get it over. So I'll throw it down now. Boom. Bunker silos covered. I will try and find some tyres. I've not found any tyres yet, because we haven't really done... The farm's not touched silage, so... What I will have to do is I will have to just find some tyres. Maybe a local farm has got some. I'll be, I've put an ad out on Facebook. And I've put an ad out on Instagram asking any local farmers. And in the, lo in the newspapers as well. Asking any local farmers if they've got any news... Any tyres. And if they have, if they can drop them off for us. We'll be grateful of them so that we can get them onto the pit and it can hold it down so I will, I've done that so hopefully we'll find out by the end of this vlog or the next vlog so but it's going to take now until at least November, end of November, December to ferment properly so that's been done we need to spread for go and get some hay out really so I'm going to do the cow field last because the mower's up there because I'm not going to I'm not going to interfere with their work all day because it going in and out going in and out they're having to move things all day I don't want to do that they said I said that I'm going to go in now and get the mower and then that be it but they did say I can keep on coming in because we are a farm around here but they're going to be down here all day, I just don't want to get into their ways, so... I'm going to get the mower out. Yeah, because I'm going to struggle to get through here. So what I'll do is I'll get the mower out. They've started to smooth things off, but... They haven't brought in the big boys yet. And I think they are wanting to take some of the scrap away, but I'm fine. It's all fine by me. It's all going under our, con our quality controlling checks. So I'll leave the gates open actually for them. Press. You'll see some. Also see some undergoing changes in field. I think it's. I've got. I've got a map now, which is much easier. I'll just have to f unfold it out. So, undergoing in field 35, which is the pig field, we'll see some changes. Field 35 and I think it's just field 35. But yeah, you'll see some undergoing changes over the next few months through December and winter. And the hidden field, which is not very hidden when I tell you about it. But the changes are, so let me just press run on this because I'll need to check things. The changes will be, I'll talk to you while I'm mowing actually, so we can get stuff done. So press on. Just check underneath, make sure all the blades are working. Perfect. So we'll back up into this corner. But yeah, the undergoing changes are Presley's farm. I said that Presley wanted to get farming, and he does. Our things, our hay and things, because 
We're sharing the hay with Farmer Ralph. He's going to bring his cows into here when the grass needs cutting over there. And plus, we can get slurry from them if we're bringing them over here. So it works two ways. He's getting milk off them from over there. He's able to produce milk from them, but then we can produce slurry and manure. That the room we've got the pit built. I'm not going to worry about the pit because we've got the slurry pit. And for now, we don't really need to be too, using two sources of slurry and manure when we can just get one or the other. Thus the farmer will be going into contractors, but I have also had a phone call from the show to say that we need to go and pick up our tractor as soon as possible, because something is going on with the field. So I need to really get over there quickly. They say the field's going under a lot of work. And if we don't pick it up by today, the tractor will be sold and scrapped. Now that's what I'm the last thing that I really, really want to happen because it was my grandest tractor. So we will, as soon as this is mowed and tethered, we will go over there while it's baking in the sun to dry, which is why I've picked a day like today where it can dry rather than a day like yesterday when it was raining. So what I'm going to have to do with mowers and things is, well, they would normally go down there, but I want to keep going in and out. So what I'm going to have to do is park it in here on the diagonal, drop it off. I'm going to go and ted that piece of field, so I'm just going to go down to the store, I'll probably do it with you guys on camera, and sort out a tether. But yes, I need to get down to my that other field to go and pick up my tractor. I've still not picked it up, you see, I've not had... I've been sorting out the yard, I've been sorting out the paperwork, so they know the deeds and assets of what they can and can't cut down. Right then, guys. So the dealership have just come back to me with this. It's a Kubota for 11,000, so yes. But it's a new branded piece of stock that they've got in at the moment to test for people to test out on demo. So we've said that we're going to buy it as we would like to try it out. So... Because I've got quite a new or old, so I'm more the ones for the new the new stock. We might as well try new. We might as well. And then they asked us to pick a colour, but I'm more happy to stick it to Kubota colours. We might as well, so that's what we're going to do. And then the rim colour, I've asked them to put on a chrome. 
I would ask for galvanised, but it's a little bit more expensive, so we have gone for it. So we're going to buy that for 11,500. And thank you, Presley. We are going to get this tethered. So that's 67 pounds left we're, we're left with. I'll just attach any straps on. Now it should all be working, they said. As they say, they've just been, they just got delivered this morning at nine o'clock. So I'm not gonna worry about it. So, back it into there. GPS, and I'll go straight up onto, I'll put the drone up already, turn them hazards off. But, I'll do the first headland with you. But I've been really planning this farm out, because this farm's now ready. We're ready to upgrade it. It's ready to be done. The time has finally come. And we have finally found the keys for the shed at the front in the cow farm. Sid managed to find them in his toolbox. There was a toolbox in the workshop area that Sid's taken over. And he, might, he found some keys, so he said just to try those keys, because they may be from that spare door. Now, we are going to try them. But I thought I'll try them on camera. But so I actually explain why I wasn't able to record. before I go into a, a time lapse. The reasons why I wasn't able to record was because I dropped my phone. I was out with a few friends and, well, I got a little bit drunk. I suppose I will call it. Some to been going out. I went out with my mum and some friends and my, and my wife and to a party and yes, it ended up in disaster. Phone broke and well, it's not an actual write off, it still works, but features on the phone don't work so. This is the last phone I'm, buy I'm buying though for myself because that's what my mum says. And so does Presley and everybody agrees. And I agree. But yes. I am now using it very wisely. And I don't really have it out now all the time. I don't really take it out all the time as such. Because, well, I'm scared. I'm scared it may happen again. It should, I hope it doesn't. Touch wood. But, that is my long story cut short. So I'm going to get this put onto a time lapse. And I will see you in a second. Well, in about more than a second.
welcome back guys to the Tedding. So you've just seen the time lapse that it's all done. I would like to put some greenhouses down just to try and equal out some more money. Because we can get a bit of a deal up at the garden centre to sell our produce to them. Which is why I could do with finding a spare pot of lamb, but we haven't really got one apart from at the back. And there is a self-made greenhouse that we can possibly build. But we need to let that Ted first. And while we do... I'm going to walk up the road and get this tractor. I'll walk up with you on camera, right? Because... I don't, I don't know if they've left it in the field. I don't know. But, and there's rain on the forecast, so this needs, I'm going to, let me just check the weather forecast on my level 6, right, so we have got a good couple of hours, I think maybe about one rain comes, I will show you where they're thinking of building a supermarket, but it probably won't be today, firstly, what's on about though, buying the, not the church, but the house behind the church, because it is up for sale, and this area of land, so he can put his farm down here, but, I'm not objecting to him doing it, but this, I've let him, I'm going to think about renting out this field here for him to use. But this is a long walk up to the, f the field. It's nice up here, and I'd love to be up here, but at the moment we can't afford to be. It would be nice just to work up here, have a field of his own up here, but I'm afraid we can't do that. So the gates are open, so that must be just to let us have his tractor in. So did they re-landscape then, have they been re-landscaping? No. They've grow the growing grass back in the field by the looks of seeds. Right, that's why I'm trying to walk around the edge, but they've not landscaped anything off. So if we're doing contracts, if we do contracts for them, it's going to be difficult to mow. I'm sure we'll work something out with them. Right, where is our tractor? Right, let's see if it's working. Oh god, it looks like the battery's either died on us or something. Well, the battery's not died because it's ticking over, but... Something's happened, right? I'm gonna have to call Sid out to come and have a look at the tractor. <sighs> See you in a second, guys. Right then, guys, so Sid's just here. Oh, start the tractor, you say. Right, I will do Sid. Oh, listen to her. Take it slow, like, right. This is where the show was, they've obviously reseeded it and things. Just, they should have leveled it out really, but it's up to them really, we don't want to get involved. I'm just trying to take it out in first gear, because that's what he said. And plus you don't really want to be damaging their field. Oh, close the gates, make it easier for me. I'll be a tight farmer and actually close the gates. It's not our problem at the end of the day, but that as well be right. Is the rain just stuck as well on Go 
any higher than that, but... So I'll get this back to the farm. Put it in cruise control. Don't think we can go above 30 in this. 21's our max speed and it's, I think it's staying that way. But, I don't know, I'm deciding whether to buy that. It's only going to be here, as I say, for today. Well, in the sale. Well, it's not going to be in the s I think they've just put it up on the sale today, so... I don't know, I, might, I think I might put a, a bid in it. Well, I have I put my bid on, so... I think I may... Well, I think when I get back to the farm, I think I might put a bid on. Ouch, I can't park it there, can I? Oh! No, I can't really. Right, top yard, top yard, it's going at the top yard. There's no indicators on this chapter. Ah, oh, no, it's workshop, says Sid. Okay, I will just do that. We must want to look into it in detail. I'll just pop it on the ramps. <laughs> Done. Right. So, close that door off for him. Actually, no, I'll leave it open because it is his space. Yeah. So, I'll bring you back in once I've got a tether sorted. Right then, so welcome back, guys. So, it's now three minutes past three. I am getting things ready. Noah has brought it all out. I've bid it on that tractor. I don't know if we've won it. If we've won it, we'll get a call today. We brought the tractor back. We are now into getting the wind rolling done. This wind roller can go back to the dealership. It's big. I'd like to say that now. It is a big wind roller. But no one will be clocking off soon. I think the I think he's going to give us a hand bringing some cows over, but he'll be cocking off. I don't even know if we're bringing the cows over tonight, because everything's going all here. Right? I think he's gone to see what the landscape people are doing, but, yes, I don't even know if the cows are going to be coming home tonight. These bales will need to come in before the rain starts. And the landscaping people have still not finished what they're doing. I think that they said they're going to be here for a good couple of days, but I've not even seen them start, so I don't know what they're actually doing. I will go and inspect on them at some point, but I don't want to be found a little bit too much of a pest to them. I don't want to be become a pest. So what I will do is I'll probably, Noah will probably help me wing He said, go around the first headland, because this is so big. Collect up the first headland. And then, just so that nothing gets trapped in the bailer. And then he'll look at taking over. With it being a tight field. He may have to work on the field slowly, but I don't know if Martha's wanting to come and have a go today. I've no idea. I know she has. This video has been recorded on a. It's Tuesday today, and I think. Yes, yeah, she's. 
out of the farm today. She's out of action today. Yeah, Tuesday is the day when a contracting job, well, we work at a different farm. So I've sent her out contracting with a mum. But yes, Noah's day for contracting is always on a Wednesday. So it's it works out evenly. I may go around another headland, but I'm just gonna lower the pickup. We'll help it for a bit. Bias. Plus it's on a quiet road around here. I don't I often see traffic, I rarely see the traffic actually. And let me just get into that field quickly. As long as these bales can be wrapped today, I am a hundred percent certain that this farm will be on track of a successful future. So I will start bailing. It should take longer to proceed because it didn't get any fertiliser on here. I'm not going to bother pH in the soil and, and uh, analysing the soil around here because it's going to be a cow field at the end of the day. It's going to have full of two twos in it. And it's not going to be the nicest of grass. Plus this field will start to get more and more deer in. We will see more and more deer with it being a cow field. Deer and cows do get along. But yes, straw will not be given to the cows until fully winter time. Which is when I probably give them a bale. And I will, I'll give them moss. I'll po possibly get manure up, but I'm more happy for the slower. But I'm not complaining. But if we have to have a manure pit built, then we will do because it's going to be well needed. So I'll get this put onto a time lapse. No, actually, no, I won't. I'll just get the field completed off camera, and I'll see you guys when the field is done. Great. Right, hey guys. So that bit of time lapse has just got lost. It's got lost on my recording. So what I am having to do, only because I pressed the wrong button and the clip accidentally got deleted. So. I did, I did bail and win over the field, and now I am just picking up the rest of these bales. Probably will be calling it it for today. should be finding out soon if we've won that bid but yeah these three bales that are here will be getting used first so I don't think I am stacking them like this because they won't be getting used first they will or at least I would stack them like that because they will be getting used first At least I did want to use these three first. But I can't even tidy up the machines because of the landscaping company. So the machines will be just left out in the field 
not good because it's going to be raining but what else are we supposed to do we haven't got shed space right that's going to stay there a minute get for driving at bales too fast. It's a good job there's no health and safety officers about today. I think there is supposed to be a sergeant that's coming round there to check on the farm quality and things. But I don't know when he's coming. He's coming with a group of inspectors but they don't like to say when they come. And they should do really. They should do, but we're going to know when they come. But yes, I think the mayor will be elected in the next episode, or we are voting to elect which mayor we want in the, on the village. So there will be a few, but I'm going to store all my machines in this clump here, because we can't get onto the yard. So, if you have enjoyed this episode, please don't forget to like and subscribe if you are new. I'll just fly up into the air. I'll send the drone up. One minute, I'll just have to get the drone out. So yeah, if you've enjoyed this episode, please don't forget to like and subscribe. Sorry for the crop markings on the ground. And until the next episode, I hope you have enjoyed, and I hope to see you all again soon. S see you again soon, and bye for now.